Uh, nothing says unwinding after work, like not being able to do that gotcha machine. You know what? Let's do some more Tour 4. I've been having fun with the heavy splatling. Like, straight up. It, it's been fun lately. I've, I've tried it a bit over the uh, last Splash Fest, but didn't really have as much of a fun time with it. But that's probably because there's the added pressure of uh, the Splash Fest and trying to do well. Like, nowadays, like, I shouldn't say nowadays, but like, currently, there's no such pressure, so it's just like, I can just do it pretty easily and, you know, actually take the time to learn it properly. Find strategies to make it work well, which, if my videos have been any evident of that lately, man, I have been doing well. Sign tells me this used to be a shipping freight yard. Like, I should. I say shipping freight yard. It's like a shipping yard, you know, that you can ship stuff out by freight. Is that applicable here? Oh no. Hold on. Do 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 do. Well, you know. Definitions from Oxford languages, according to Google. Verb. Transport goods in bulk by truck, train, ship, or aircraft. Huh. Well, you know. Of course, I did say Oxford languages because I wanted to make sure I, you know, quoted my source. Instead of being like that Metal Gear Rising Revenge in the speed, which like, that's a nice argument, Senator. Why don't you back it up with a source? Source? My source is made is that I made the frick up. I'm sure everyone's seen that meme by now. Also, what the heck is going on? I mean, I, like, yeah, I know the games have been, like, really good lately, but a wipeout. Man, the teammates I have are just decimating. Last time I had this kind of decimation was during Splashfest. And even then, there's, like, hardly ever a wipeout in, like, an opposing team. So it's just like, man... just super competitive and stuff and meanwhile I'm just kind of chilling uh, someone tells me I should not do like competitive splat leaks I'm sure that's something I could consider in the future maybe depending on how well I do but that's a future thing I have to deal with or at least worry about for now, let's just focus on the here and now, try to enjoy things as much as possible, you know? Of course, I get <laughs> splatted last second. Not sure it really matters, though, but hey. Important thing is we won. Team did good. I tried to contribute as best I can, and I guess it paid off. Well, you know. Might as well gain another round of turf war with heavy splatling because I just want a vibe. Can this just be a vibing episode? No mean sound effects? Is that allowed on this channel? I mean, I've already done a, at least one Hades video without memes just because it's a long, well, well, I mean, one, fast, runs tend to be pretty long, and two, that game is just fun as it is. Also, how the frick did they reach our base already? The round just, like, 
Only 30 seconds of the round, and man, they are just already here. We're gonna have to drive them out. We're gonna have to stand a chance. And here I just wanted to vibe, man. Hot damn, dude. Freaking chill. They wiped our entire team with a frick. What the frick is going on? What's transpiring? Man. Something feels really coordinated about this. Because there's no way. There's no way this is not coordinated in any way, shape, or form. Like, come on, man. There's something up about this. Either they're really good or they're really coordinated. Or both. Could be both, actually. Well, at least got them out. All I gotta do is just cover up some of this enemy ink. How the frick are they back already? The frick, no. The frick out. Like, come on, man. I know I'm being hypocritical, but man. Don't you be so freaking savage within like the first 30 seconds of the round. At least wait a minute for going into your enemy's base. Of course, I'm here talking like I'm trying to keep Turf Wars freaking honorable in some way, shape, or form. Yeah, it's whatever. Yeah, that's what I get for trying to add honor to something that's just supposed to be competitive. Honor amongst comp- How the frick are they back already?! Get the frick out, dude! Yeah, there we go. Got them out. <laughs> they were trying to dodge roll out of the way, but we were not having it. My teammates and I, me, me, I, I, me, language, saying the words with the stuff. Me and I'm just trying to ink everything. <laughs> Wipe out! <laughs> there we go, right at the end. Man, talk about a comeback. Number one popular target, number one super jump spot. Why does everyone choose me to jump to anyway? You know, as much as I'm having fun with this, I think. I think I want this to be my last round for a while. I don't want to burn myself out too much. But man, whatever strategy I've adopted for Turf War has been working out pretty well. At least with the heavy splatling. Of course, uh, hopefully I can remember that for the future. So I wonder if I can come up with any other strategies for any other weapons. Because I remember using this Platana, like, however long ago. I think it was, like, way back when the game first launched, and I was decent enough at out. But yeah, like, I think I want to try to get back into the Splatana again, cause, yeah, and stuff. Oh. Even though it's in there until it's too late. Frick. Hopefully I can warm my team in time. I think I did, actually, yeah. Nice. Always feels good when you warm your team and they end up, you know, not making the same mistakes you did. That always feels nice. Because it, it just feels like you're contributing something positive to the team. You know, you, like even if you're not as skilled as anyone else, like you feel like you're contributing just a little bit of something. And if you can go a long way, then yeah, that means something to me. And yeah, it seems kind of foolish, but like small acts like that just can feel really good. Especially when it's, you know, reciprocated and, like, 
you know, there's also like an added effort of like cooperation, coordination, and teamwork. Oh yeah, it makes me sound selfish and self-centered, blah blah blah, but I am definitely the kind of person to like want to help people and I always like I feel good like just happy whenever you know people are happy that I'm helping them in like in a positive way and I have been getting better by like not expecting anything in return because like yeah people may not be able to you know return the favor in any way shape or form and that's fine you know things happen you know I've been trying to make sure that I, you know, help out and contribute the best I can with my skills and abilities. And, like, if there's people who can do something better than I can, I'm just like, hey, look, I can't do this, you know, go to them, they can do it better. Because then at least that way I'm pointing them in the right direction, and that just feels good. Am I the only one who's like that? Is that weird? It's probably weird. Especially in this day and age, but eh, whatever. Maybe there's a better way to go about things, but I'll worry about that on my own time, not in the video. But yeah, according to my word, I am going to wrap it up here. Man, I'm acting like it's a let's play. Also, speaking of let's plays. What people want to see me do? Let's play in this day and age. I don't know. Let me let me know down in the comments. I'll figure something out from there.